channel. For this week's video, I wanted to show you guys around my minimalist loft. It's been a while since I moved in here. I think we've been living here for about four months now, but I feel like I finally got it complete how I wanted to, so I wanted to show you guys around. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So this is the door, obviously, and this is what you see as soon as you walk into the apartment, which is the doggo. No, I'm just kidding. This is the living room, so that's the first thing you kind of walk into when you walk into my loft, and there's some stairs in the kitchen. But over here is the only wardrobes we kind of have in the house. They're very, very tall, as you can see. They're a lot taller than the door, so it means we get a lot of built-in storage, and this is where I keep Benji, my dog stuff, his food bowls, and his toys. So that's kind of his little corner of the house. And these first two doors essentially have all of our clothes in them. So this bottom one has meds and extra sheets and cleaning material and things like that, and then this is where I keep all my cleaning supplies. And then over here I have sort of a in-home gym kind of little workout kit and my socks and underwear. And then these are my bottoms and tops and my sweaters. This shelf here is a mess, but it's sort of what we need to grab as we leave the house. So these are Benji's little poop bags, um, my purses, my sunglasses, keys, that kind of thing. This is all of my boyfriend's stuff. We both only use one shelf for all of our clothes. That's kind of our office shelf, so in that box I have important letters and stuff. Then there's our luggage and up there it's actually our snowboard. So we keep our snowboards up on top of the closet. You can reach it really easily through the stairs. So in this one over here we have all of our jackets, so both winter and summer. And then all of our shoes and it's a little bit messy, I should clean this up. But this is where we keep all of our shoes. And then up here there's and then up here there's actually my workout clothes in my pajamas and then some travel accessories and then more bags and more bags basically <laughs> that's pretty much it over here and some snowboarding clothes too so after that you walk in and you kind of walk into the living room slash kitchen area so this is my living room and this is my kitchen. If you guys are interested in seeing a full kitchen tour, I'm going to leave a card up in the top corner so that you guys can go ahead and see how I've organized all of my kitchen. But briefly, I just keep all of my cups and plates and pans up there. That's the fridge, that's the microwave oven. This is where I keep extra things and that's the trash under the sink. This right here under the step is kind of a Harry Potter miniature shenanigan thing and I keep the vacuum cleaner and all of Benji's food. And then you take the stairs up here, there's a baby gate to keep my dog from going up there because it's actually pretty dangerous. It doesn't really have a very high wall um, as you can see here. But yeah, this is my bed sleeping area and this is our dog's crates. I recently renewed this, so if you guys want to see what I did, I will leave the card right here so you guys can see it. This is the living room from above. And we actually tend not to walk on here. I'm only walking on here to show you guys, but this is also the dining room area that you can see from up here, which we also use as an office area. This is the sticker that I just added to the wall. Like I said, you guys can watch that renovation in my other video, but we can go back downstairs now. So right here is the little coffee corner and it's just sitting on top of an extra freezer we have because we like having a freezer. We actually painted this freezer black, it was originally white. And this is a little pantry. I also made a video of how I organized my pantry and how I came up with this idea. So I will leave that card right here. But essentially we have all of the foods that don't need to be refrigerated. And then right here we actually have my little living room and this sofa opens to be a sofa bed so if I have people staying over they can actually sleep 
on this couch. The windows are really nice because they have like this industrial feel to them and they let in a lot of light. Like I said, the windows let in a lot of light, which is super nice. My plant up there is dying, but that's a different story. And then this is the view I have from my apartment. To the left, there's actually a little harbor with boats, and to the right, there's just a main road and a main street, and a little Lidl supermarket, which is extremely convenient to have right outside of our door. But this is what my view looks like. And finally, we have the little dining room area right here. And it's just a table. This table is from Ikea and it actually opens up so that you can have basically four people sitting on each side, which is super handy. And obviously I work from home, so I use this space as my office space during the day when we're not eating meals. This is what the upstairs looks like from downstairs and the rest of the house looks like from this angle. So as you can tell, the space is pretty small, but it's big enough for two people, which I really like. And right here is the little bathroom. It sits underneath the bedroom and it just has a shower and a toilet, obviously, and the sink right here. The storage space in this house is awesome. All of our products actually are behind this mirror, which is amazing. Please ignore how dirty my shower is. I didn't actually have time to clean it before I filmed this video. And I just have a little letter board right here and small details. And behind this door actually sits my washing machine, which is super convenient. And it just finished a wash, so I have to get that out. But it's a little bit messy in here, but it has all the washing liquid, our laundry basket, some hair ties, and extra stuff. But yeah, this is pretty much all of the apartment. And here's my puppy once again stealing the show. Thank you so much for watching this video guys. If you guys liked it, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. Leave me a comment letting me know what part of my house you like the most and whether this has inspired you to sort of move some things around in your own house. I really love having you guys around and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.